destructive outcomes. One needs to discover and cut the pornography problem at its root, doing so by uncovering as to exactly what is triggering one to view such images and videos. If one identifies his or her triggers, then one would be able to create strategies that would empower them to avoid such acts. Is watching movies or social media a trigger which inspires you to watch pornography? Is loneliness or some common emotion triggering or urging you to watch pornography? Is it boredom, sadness, stress, anxiety, or loneliness? Realize that God the Almighty, the All-Knowing, the All-Seeing is watching you at all times, and you are not alone. He knows the stealthy looks and that which the breasts conceal. Quran 40:19. Do not look at the smallest of the evil deed, rather look at the greatness of the one whom you are disobeying. If you do fall back and commit such acts, always repent and follow your sin with a good deed, as good deeds compensate for bad deeds. Indeed, good deeds do away with misdeeds. Quran 11:114. Pray to God to seek forgiveness, also seeking help and guidance in the process. Perform and perfect your prayers with the utmost humility and concentration. Indeed, prayer prohibits immorality and wrongdoing. Quran 29 45. To totally avoid pornography consumption, one will need to keep himself or herself busy with protective activities, such as reading, exercise, sports, school, going to the mosque, chores, or errands. A pornography addict is characterized as one whose brain is marked by the compulsive use of pornography, which proves difficult to stop despite all its negative consequences and often worsens over time. It is said that the addiction to pornography is more serious than the addiction to certain drugs, as narcotics like cocaine and crack can be detoxed and cleansed from the body, whereas pornographic images can be much harder to remove from the brain. For those that watch pornography occasionally or are fully addicted, hope is not lost, as the addiction is reversible and God is all forgiving. Never give up hope and continue to seek forgiveness every time you slip, regardless of the number of times you have committed this sin in the past, and no matter how great this sin. Always remember that Allah's mercy is far greater and God loves to forgive. God states, Say, O my servants who have transgressed against themselves. Do not despair of the mercy of Allah. Indeed, Allah forgives all sins. Indeed, it is He who is the forgiving, the merciful. Quran 39:53. On the other hand, also realize that much like a seed that grows into a large tree, one's sins can grow bigger and turn into an addiction that will be far more difficult to conquer. So start your resistance efforts now and do not procrastinate. A Muslim is one that realizes the oncoming approach of Judgment Day and the fact that everyone on this day will be held accountable for the actions they committed through their lives. One's own body parts can potentially testify against you for using them to disobey the Creator. God the Almighty states on the Day of Judgment, until when they reach it, their hearing and their eyes and their skins will testify against them of what they used to do. Quran 14:21. Lowering one's gaze comes with many benefits. When one lowers their gaze, they are in obedience to God's commands. Lowering one's gaze purifies the heart and the soul and illuminates the heart. It increases one's wisdom, steadfastness, courage, and the quality of intuition. The one that lowers his or her gaze will feel the sweetness and pleasure of his or her iman, faith in their heart. Whereas little scientific research has been completed specifically regarding the effects and benefits of abstaining from pornography for addicts or heavy users, abstaining from such acts is reported to boost confidence, make one less anxious, especially if they suffer from social anxiety, improve one's social life, increase motivation, increase sensitivity, improve health or one's sex life, improve stamina, increase clarity of the mind, and lessen brain fog, improve self-control, and better one's quality of sleep. The act of resisting urges also can help one develop discipline and willpower in their life, which is sure to help them in other aspects of their lives. Realize, my dear brother or sister, that when you divert your eyes away for God's sake, He will compensate you with that which is far better and beneficial than that which you averted your gaze from.